fun and learning. Welcome, young learners. Today we'll be visiting a farm with this farm animal puzzle. We will learn about some of the animals that live on a farm. Are you ready to get going? All right, come on. The first thing we see when we get to the farm is the big red barn. Do you see the big red barn puzzle piece? Yes, there it is. The barn is where some of the animals sleep at night. The first animal we are looking for is white with black spots and makes milk for the farm. Do you know what animal we are looking for? Correct, the cow. Our next animal is pink and likes to get dirty by rolling around in the mud. Do you see a pink animal? Yes, the pig is pink. The next animal we are looking for is the brown horse. The horse is used for many things on a farm. It can be used to pull a cart of heavy farming supplies or to pull a plow so the farmer can plant crops. Can you help me find the brown horse? Great job. There it is. <coughs> the next animal we see on our farm has wings to fly, but also has webbed feet to swim. Do you know what animal we're looking for? Right, we're looking for the duck. There's the duck with its little ducklings. <coughs> Our next animal is gray and often has a long beard. We can use its milk to make cheese. Can you guess what animal we're looking for? Correct. We're looking for the goat. Here's the gray goat. <laughs> the next animal we are looking for is the sheep. It has long white fur, which we can use to make clothes. Do you see the sheep? That's right. Here's the sheep. <laughs> The last animal we see on our visit to the farm makes eggs for us to eat. Do you know what animal we're looking for? Great job! We're looking for the chicken. Our chicken is right here. And she has a little chick with her. <laughs> Wow, young learners, that was a fabulous trip to the farm. I hope you had as much fun as me learning about some of the animals on a farm. If you did, please like and subscribe for more fun and learning videos. Bye bye. Hello, young learners. Today, we're going to be putting these animal puzzles together. Can you help me find all the pieces? Yeah! Well, come on then. Let's get started. To see what animal we're looking for, we have to spell out its name. Okay. The first letter is round. Hmm, it must be the O. The O is round. The next letter has three points at the top. One, two, three. Hmm, ah, it's the W. The last letter is a straight line. Oh look, we have an L. 
That spells owl. Our animal is an owl. Let's put the owl puzzle together. Yeah! Look, this must be the first piece. It has the number one on it. It's the owl's head and goes right here. Here is puzzle piece number two. It looks like eyes. Do you see a piece with a number three on it? Ah, right. Number three is the owl's body. Piece number four is the owl's wing. Hmm, does it go right here? No, that doesn't fit. Oh, look, it fits here. Our last piece is piece number five. Look, that completes our owl puzzle. To see what animal puzzle we're working on, we need to spell out its name. Okay. The first letter we're looking for is the letter F. Hmm, ah, here is the letter F. The next letter we're looking for is a straight line with a, a round top. Hmm, ah, look, we have an eye. The third letter has two curves, hmm, just like the S. Our last letter has a straight line with a curved part. Hmm, ah, here's the letter H. It's the piece we're looking for. Our puzzle is a fish. Let's put the fish together. Look, here's part number one. It's the fish face. Piece number two is here. And it is the fish's back. The puzzle piece with the number three is what we're looking for next. Hmm, ah, here it is. And it is the fish's stomach. This is piece number four. And it's a fin. The last piece we're missing is the missing tail. And it's piece number five. That completes our fish puzzle. To see what animal we're looking for, we need to spell out its name. Okay. The first letter has a straight line and a half circle. Hmm. Just like this B. The second letter looks like a circle with a bite taken out of it. Hmm, ah, I bet the E goes there. Yes, it does. The next letter has a rounded top and a rounded bottom. I bet the A fits there. The last letter has a short straight side and a small curve. That's right. It's an R. So the animal puzzle we'll be putting together is a bear. Hmm. Piece number one is the bear head. I think piece number two looks like the bear's body. Let's try it. Yes, that's what it is. Look here. Piece three and piece four are the same. I believe they are the bear's arms. Yes, look at this. They fit perfect. That means piece five and piece six are the bear feet. Look. That completes our bear puzzle. To see what animal puzzle we are working on, we need to spell out its name. Okay. The first letter we need is the letter F. Hmm, aha! Here is the letter F. 
The next letter we're looking for has a short straight part and a curved top. Ah, just like this R. Our third letter is round. Ah, this O is round. I bet it fits. Yes. The last letter looks like a small circle with a curved tail. Just like this G. Our animal puzzle is a frog. Ribbit, ribbit. Here is puzzle piece number one. It is the frog's face. Oh look, the piece that goes here and here are both round. I think pieces two and three will go here. Our next piece is piece number four. It looks like the frog's body. That means pieces five and six are the frog's legs. Hooray! That completes the frog's puzzle. To see what animal puzzle we are working on, we need to spell out its name. Okay. The first piece looks like a straight lion. Hmm, ah, the L looks like it should fit. The second letter looks like a short straight line with a round top. Hmm, ah, the eye. I. I bet the eye fits here. Yes. The next letter is a circle. Ah, the O is a circle. The last letter has a short straight line with a curved line coming out of its top. Hmm, just like the N. The animal puzzle is a lion. Puzzle piece number one is the lion's head. It looks like the next two pieces will be the front paws. Hmm. Piece two and piece three fit perfectly. The piece with the number four looks like the lion's back legs. Yes, it fits here. The only piece missing is the tail. Look, number five is a tail. That completes the lion puzzle. To see what animal puzzle we are working on, we need to spell out its name. Okay. The first letter has a straight line and a half circle. Do you see a piece like that? Hmm, yes, the letter D. Our next letter looks like two lines with a curved bottom connecting. Hmm, ah, the U. It looks like the U. The third letter looks like almost a circle. Hmm, ah, the C. The C will fit there. The last letter of this animal's name is a K. This animal puzzle is a duck. Quack, quack. This is puzzle piece number one. It is the duck's bill. Puzzle piece number two looks like the duck's head. Yes, that's what it is. This is the next piece. This is piece number three, and it goes right here. Puzzle piece number four is the duck's belly. 
our next piece is piece number five. Piece number five looks like duck's wings. Yes, it's duck's wings. The last piece goes right here. That means that piece number six is the tail. It's the duck's tail. And that completes our duck puzzle. Great job, young learners. You helped me find all the pieces to our animal puzzles. I hope you enjoyed this activity as much as I did. Please like and subscribe for more fun and learning videos. Bye-bye.